Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's currently a new week for my vlog. I wasn't able to post on Sunday only because I was I wasn't feeling well at all. I was so sick. So I didn't upload last Sunday, so I do apologize for that. So this week I want to show you guys a week in my life as a case manager working from home. So with the whole virus going on, Medicaid approved for us to do to still provide services for our clients through Zoom, the app, the virtual video chat app. So that's pretty good because that reduces our exposure and reduces the client's exposure. So just to keep everybody safe with the whole quarantine going on. I explained that earlier when I was outside, but I think the noise was so loud that you probably couldn't hear what I was saying. So I just want to start my intro over again. So this is, it's currently Tuesday afternoon. I'm kind of starting this vlog a little bit late. I finished one of my initial visits through zoom at 10 a.m didn't didn't go through they didn't answer so that was a cancellation and then i had an interview at 12 i just finished it i think it went well so now it's almost two and i have to get ready for my last initial visit for the day so hopefully that goes through i need to call them to confirm to see and hopefully everything goes well I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah Can you tell me why, can you tell me why I'm down, yeah No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah Now I'm thinking I, now I'm thinking I Might have caught the June blues, yeah I wanna drown myself inside the juice, yeah You know I keep on running from the client's mom is on our way back from the grocery store so we'll just have to wait a little bit to start the initial visit so tbd hey guys so it's been a minute since i've heard back from my client i think what the plan is going to be like reschedule it because i think she's probably busy um she has like seven kids in her household so i think that's probably going to be the plan because she hasn't gotten back to me yet so i think the the plan for the rest of the day is to really apply for apply to some jobs and then we call her back later on and to see if she wants to schedule it for tomorrow so um so yeah so we'll see where it goes from there hey guys what's up it's currently wednesday afternoon so literally this entire morning i've been just writing my notes so nothing really crazy um i was just updating all my notes making sure like i have a copy of it as well as the notes being transferred onto credible so that's what i've been doing all morning um right now i'm going to be making some calls for my clients because we really need to what well, i need to figure out one of my clients current academic situation because he's not sure what grade he's in so they gave me permission to talk to his guidance counselor and his principal just to see where what what's the whole ordeal so hopefully i can make headway on that and also i needed to contact a few of my clients that i have not been able to reach so hopefully i have some success in that so yeah so let's get to it
So right now we are currently getting some Chipotle. Jake ordered it through his app. So right now we're picking it up and seems like there are a lot of restaurants closed because of the whole virus thing, which is very, it makes you look at life differently because I'm now realizing how much I took going out for granted and honestly this really sucks literally the only good thing i can think of right now is that there's less traffic like it didn't take as much to get here so it's, it's so crazy for chipotle we have to order and then obviously you have to go to the door tell them your name and then they'll give you the order so um but yeah it's so crazy how this virus has completely changed the entire world like day-to-day -day life um it's really crazy but yeah we're starving so hopefully we'll get the food in no time go home and crush the chipotle bowl so stay tuned hey guys what's going on it's currently friday afternoon yesterday i didn't do much well i did mainly like case notes making sure all of my notes are up to date on the system so that's basically what i did yesterday and then eli and i found a new bun mi cafe and davy got some bun mi and some bubble tea so that was exciting but yeah now just bring you guys up to date on what i'm doing right now i am researching some healthcare insurance options for one of my clients so right now she's 21 she's unemployed she she hasn't worked a day in her life but she's technically still in school well technically she's in a program so because of that for some reason she's not qualified to be on her dad's medicaid plan because she's 21. i have to do my research and see how i can link her to a medicaid option on her own plan so yeah basically i'm just calling i've been calling for like the last hour and these places have been literally giving me the runarounds like first i called the medicaid office then they sent me to their regional office and then the regional office sent me to the florida state office and then the florida state office sent me to dcf because she suggested me for my client to apply medicaid through dcf now for dcf that is a whole other ballpark because their operating system is so so complicated like i can't get a hold of any customer representative so that's a little bit frustrating i've been doing that for the last hour um, i had to take a mental break because the operating services was just sending me to different places and they kept asking me for the case number and the social security which i do have but then it's like i just need general information you know like i i'm not trying to apply for medicaid yet for my client i just need well, i have questions that need answers so i've been doing that lately and i'm gonna give it a, another try <laughs> and see where it goes from there so wish me luck okay so <clears throat> i was on the phone literally dealing with the operator for like 15 minutes like it just and prior to that before i did my little lunch break i was on the phone for like 25 minutes so i'm obviously not going to get through to them today and it's pretty literally like later on in the day it's a friday too so i don't think i'm gonna get through with dcf today so i'm gonna keep trying but this is like one of the frustrating things about being a case manager because you really have to do your own research for your clients that's not the frustrating part at all like i love doing the research i like to see what's out there especially for the state of florida which is you know obviously i moved down here from from the dc maryland virginia area so this is a complete new ballpark for me <clears throat> the frustrating thing about it is like just coming to dead ends and not really finding the solutions that your clients need even though it's so even though it's out there but it's still hard for you to find the right resources for them and my client definitely needs health insurance like that's one of the biggest struggles here in america is having a affordable health insurance because that's just that's a necessity you know it's not like a want it's a necessity so finding that for some of my clients has been very challenging i think what i'm going to do is probably reach out to some of my colleagues to see 
what they've been using to help their clients maybe because again i'm still fairly new at this and we have other case managers who've been around for years and they've built their own resource organization so i'm going to check and see about that but yeah, I'm just going to give my client a call to just give her the update that I literally did not even make a dent in calling DCF. So I'm going to try again on Monday. I also need to create two new service plans for my new clients and schedule a Zoom appointment for Monday so they can approve it. If they need to add anything, then we can add it. And then I also need to review some clinical documentations for my other clients that I haven't been I didn't get around to so for me to I'm already missing like the the compliance hours so um, I really need to review those documentations in order for me to be in compliance so that's honestly really the plan for the rest of today again it's Friday so I think I may need to have some calls for tomorrow so my job usually is all week sometimes i do dedicate time to myself where i don't look at emails i don't work on my case notes and that's usually that's usually like between saturday and sunday so i may just use sunday as like my off day but tomorrow i might have to make sure some of my clients are okay check on some notes the sunday is the pay period deadline for all of our notes so i need to make sure all of my notes are in by sunday yeah i think that's the rest that i think that's the plan for the rest of the days i've been on my way up now it's really far down I don't think I'll feel it when I hit the ground In October it feels like summertime I keep falling for you like every night Been communicating through satellites, yeah It's black and white I'm all up in the clouds when it's pouring rain Ain't never coming down unless you call my name Yeah, we should take it slow, just like day by day Like day by day I'm all up in the clouds when it's pouring rain Ain't never coming down 